case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. An intriguing legal dispute has emerged between a key manufacturer of bowling equipment and three bowling centers under the corporate umbrella of Treadway Companies, Inc., leading to scrutiny by the Supreme Court of the United States. Taking center stage in Brunswick Corp v. Pueblo Bolo Mat, Inc., a 1977 case, was the question of whether competitors being allowed to continue business due to a violation of Section 7 antitrust laws can be sufficiently damaging to warrant relief. The drama was set in motion when the manufacturer, the petitioner in this case, swooped in on four defaulting bowling centers, which were located in three different markets. These centers previously fell under the ownership of the respondents, Treadway Companies, Inc. Allegedly, the petitioner's acquisition was in violation of antitrust laws. Subsequently, the Court of Appeals concurred with this claim, yet deemed a new trial necessary due to improper jury instructions. Key to this case was the determination of the validity of antitrust damages in a unique scenario, when the only injury claimed is continuing business competition. Furthermore, the court investigated whether or not a failure of acquired centers to go bankrupt, causing a loss of income for the plaintiffs, fits within the purview of antitrust law damages. The judicial tides turned in favor of the petitioner, who was granted a new trial due to inconsistencies and blunders in the district court's damage instruction. This, however, was not the final blow. The court granted judgment on the damages claim to the petitioner, citing that respondents had failed to prove pertinent damages. It was surmised that the definition of injury per antitrust laws did not encompass the contemporary circumstances put forth by the respondents. The verdict brought the curtain down on this act of the legal drama. But the story continues. Navigating the contours of the Supreme Court's judgment, the case is now being remanded for further consistent proceedings. As it stands, to paraphrase Charles Dickens, this is a tale of antitrust laws. It's a tale of bowling alleys. It's the epic of legal clarity. It's the epic of legal confusion. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.